Today on SirenNet, we bring you a new product from the gang at Whelan Engineering, and it is going to help you when it comes to mounting your lighting products. It is the Quick Fit roof mount. What this platform does is it allows your Ford, Chevy, and Dodge truck, make sure to take a look at our drop down menu so you can order those appropriately, but it takes this great platform, affixes it onto the back of the cab at the third brake light so you don't have to put any holes into the vehicle. Factory third brake light comes off and this platform is going to go into its place with a bit of hardware and details included in the instructions. So how this works, and for those of you curious, we can also get it for you in a white powder coated finish versus the black. It's a few different pieces that put this fixture together. So this piece here is what will go onto the vehicle. The top cover here is actually where you are going to do some measuring and drill some holes for mounting. So for example, if we have a responder series bar, we'd want to take this platform portion here, have it removed from this, of course, so you don't have any marring or holes going into this in spots you don't want. Line the bar up with the top, making sure that you have suitable clearance on the sides, the front and the back. Pop the dome, mounting locations for the four hardware points. Don't forget about the wiring harness. And then you can go ahead and cinch everything up from the bottom. So the bar, the beacon, whatever other accessories going on here, very nice and secured. Your wiring harness is also going to disappear as it will be tucked into this portion here. So it will be fed into here. So this open portion, that's where hardware is going to drop into. Wiring, you can tuck that away in here. Even with a mini bar like the responder, where we have a multitude of pigtails. Maybe you don't need to run all of those into the vehicle into your switching, but you want to still have them accessible. Just cap them off, leave the pigtails in there, and it's easy to get to them later on in the future if you wanted to make pattern changes, for example. So on this part of it, the bracketry here, this is going to adjust itself differently between the third brake light. Again, Chevy, Ford, and Dodge. So when you have this secured onto the vehicle, your factory third brake light will remount onto this front black polycarbonate portion. Wiring harness will drop in here. Sides are open for your cargo lights if that's part of your third brake light. But speaking of wiring, with a hole in an appropriate spot into the channel here, that will drop it so it drops into the opening inside here. So your harness from your product, that gets routed behind the third brake light and routed through the cab. So really nice way that this is all put together by wheel and engineering. So all you have to do, out of the box, Take the top, get it set up for what's going on top of it, drill the holes, drop the wiring, make extensions through here, route it, and put it back on the vehicle. And it's that simple. So greatest thing about this, if you're worried about vehicles, you don't want to put any holes in them. You don't have to do it this way. If you have magnetic products and you switch to newer vehicles that are made out of aluminum, not steel, well, now this gives you an application where you can mount it because we have them in aluminum, so that's perfect for a permanent mount. But in steel, your magnetic mounted product, you can go ahead, take that, and right on top. So it'll be a nice strong hold. Just remember, don't be using those when the vehicle is in motion and you're driving around town. So there you have it, the Wheel and Engineering Quick Fit Mini Bar Platform. Well, I shouldn't say Mini Bar Platform because you can use it for a multitude of products, including work lights and antennas. So also a neat thing that I'm thinking about this now, if you're including a traffic advisor into your vehicle, Make some brackets, attach them here, traffic advisor goes on, beacon up here, strap some work lights on, and a really nifty little platform you have for a lot of accessories. I'm Chris, thanks for joining me today on SirenNet Television, and to stay up to date, like, subscribe, and of course, we always love to hear from you in the comments section.